Well, now let's take a look at the coronavirus cases across the U.S. There are now nearly 700,000 confirmed cases and more than 37,000 deaths. Just over 59,000 people who contracted COVID-19 have recovered. In Kentucky, there have been 134 new cases of the coronavirus confirmed and eight new deaths. That brings us to a total of 2,522 cases in the state. Kevin Christopher is live in the LEX 18 newsroom with the latest from Frankfurt. Kevin. Good evening, Nancy. In addition to Governor Bashir letting Kentuckians know about the number of new cases in the state, he also took a lot of time to discuss plans to get the economy and the state back open again and said we may be able to see some easing of restrictions in early May. Cases. Governor Bashir says there are certain benchmarks from the White House that should be in place before we begin that process. And that includes a decrease in the number of cases over 14 days. The second recommendation would be hospitals being able to take care of all existing cases within the normal health care system, not out at field hospitals. And there should be good testing available for health care workers. Governor Bashir says contact tracing will go back to being very important. We have to have the ability to handle a surge, especially in the ICUs. We have to be able to protect those in our senior living facilities. Have to. Um, even when you look at the, the phases, once we get to them, everybody in the risk zone under the federal proposal is still sheltering in place. I mean, it's, you know, while it is, it is gradual and there is reopening in the proposal, I mean, it's, it's still going to be pretty tough on, on uh, a lot of our, our people in order to, to protect them. Uh, and finally, uh, and this is one that, that Dr. Stack made sure that I would cover, is that we got to be flexible, we've got to be fluid. Uh, the White House is saying that um, as you open up, you may see spikes, you may see changes, and you got to be able to respond. Bashir says the White House advice guidance states that as states open up, there may be changes or spikes in cases, and Kentucky, again, needs to be prepared to respond to those changes. Nancy?